and thank you for this uh, supporters and also and especially for those members for the level one and level two in our youtube community and for this video i will release the arts engineering beam section designer uh, version 1.0 intended for the level two members okay and without further ado let's open the application actually this is the excel application only but it's good enough uh, to design the section okay so this is the output interface in some of previous na mga tutorial natin as you can see uh, this is only the checking the design of the flexure and the chair so for the checking of ser serviceability and the crack with uh, checking so if a follow up na lang natin to follow na lang okay then also i have already updated the section ito mas ma malinis sa mata <laughs> okay so mag update siya uh, depending on the, our result result then if you haven't re uh, subscribed and followed our facebook and uh, youtube channel click lang ninyo to guys then you can follow me in YouTube, in Facebook. Also, subscribe in my YouTube channel. And also, aside from design button, I also created the report button if you want to save this in PDF. Okay. And okay, let's insert a data or input data here, value. So, maximize ko na lang yan. Then, as you can see pala, uh, Malinis na siyang tingnan nat yung interface natin, no? So, dinisable ko lahat ng mga toolbars natin. Which is mas maganda, no? Okay, let's use this one. This is the value of a prime is 28 <clears throat> for 15 for the FY. Then, 20,000 for the reinforcement modulus of elasticity. Then, let's use 300 and 450. Then, cover of 40. Then also let's use for the initial value of 16 and 2, 16 and 2. So this is our initial value for the uh, for reinforcement. Okay. For the applied forces, so let's use 100 uh, ultimate share and 150 ultimate moment of the section. Then click design. Please wait. And as you can see. Generated design completed. Then also we we will see this uh, interface the message box every time magi click the design button. Okay. Then as you can see, uh, singly the reinforcement siya as per the section. Then nag update yung section natin. See. Tapos yung stirrups natin. Ito. Then, kung ano man yung concrete cover. Pero kung makikita natin dito, yung <clears throat> tension natin na ratio is 2.78, which is less uh, greater than sa 1.0. So, we need to apply more reinforcement in the bottom. So, ito, 2.78, medyo malaki yan na habulin natin. Let's use 20. Uh, let's use 5. Then, click. Please wait. Design completed. Uh, so, ibig sabihin, mali pala yung naan na. <laughs> this is top, top bars. Should be bottom bars. Okay, 20. Then, I will return this to 6, 216. Okay. It should be 5. This is bottom bars, guys. Please wait. Design completed. So, as you can see, our ratio for the capacity over the uh, this is the ratio of the used over the required okay uh, okay this is required if this is eleven thousand eh. let's calculate this one 
So this one 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 thousand one hundred twenty-three pala. Divide natin sa one five seventy point eight. So yun. Ibig sabihin this the required over the uh, area used yung ginamit natin. Okay. So okay siya. No, kasi mas malaki yung ginamit natin ko per sa requirement. So as you can see, yung section natin mas maganda to. Mas madaling intindihin. Then, for example, uh, we change this height into 400, tapos 250. Then of course, i-increase natin yung share natin into 150, then 200 for the moment. Please wait. Design completed. Okay. So this is our section. Pero sa ting sa kung makikita ninyo, the bottom bars is greater than 1.0 which is it should be less than. Also the top bars. So we need to increase this one. Uh, you have the option, one is to increase the, the quantity of the 20mm rebar or you can increase the diameter of the rebar and uh, reduce the quantity of the rebar or you can make it the same quantity, okay? So for this, uh, let's try to increase the quantity of rebar. Then by the way, the in this section design, the spacing of the rebar is not yet checked. So, probably in the next tutorial, we will incorporate that, the checking of the spacing of the rebar. Okay? And uh, with 16, uh, we will use this as 3, 16 mm. Then, please, please wait. Design completed. As you can see, now our top bars is okay. The ratio is 76% only. So while in the bottom bars, as you can see, it's 100%. So 0, 0 share. So meaning, uh, para safer, so we need to increase that one, then let's decrease that one. Please wait. Design completed. Okay, see? So this is okay. So our section will be 250 by 400. Our bottom bars is 5 pieces of 25 mm rebar. And our top bars is 3 pieces of 16 mm uh, rebar. And our stirrups will be two legged uh, 10 mm stirrups at 160 mm uh, on the center. Okay. So this is our updated uh, beam section design for flexure and shear only. After your design, if you want to export this to PDF, the report, so just click the report button. Then save this beam or write your desired name of this report okay so let's use beam uh, design section report generated report this one so as pdf nasha guys okay version 1.0 so i will Post this to the community and for this is intended for the level 2 members. And for the members and level 2, so you can obtain this one. Okay. Uh, that's all for today. And please stay tuned sa mga next tutorial natin. And we will update this one uh, so that may mga checking pa tayo sa iba. Serviceability, crack width, and the spacing of the river. Okay. Ilang guys, thank you for watching and for supporting my channel. Take care. God bless.